Hey everybody, we're going to be doing a alcohol, dripping alcohol ink into resin and seeing the effects that come from that. Um, what I've got here is I've already got resin inside some containers. I pre-mixed it off camera. It's the Platinum Clear Epoxy 2 to 1 and also these inks are from a Jacquard Piñata brand and I'll run through some colours. There is uh, white which is very important for this style. Uh, this one is some bright yellow. There is sapphire blue and Senorita Mar... <laughs> I, can... I stumble on this one every time. Senorita Magenta. So, um, this is the what they've called Petri dish. Um, the effects are crazy amazing. Like at first when I saw them I wasn't too crash hot but now that I've created some and I've literally can pick them up in my hand and look into the depths of what is created, it is simply magical, like totally amazing. So what we're doing is you drip in the colors and then you drip white over those colors. And then that's it and you can layer the colors and whatnot and then you just leave it to cure so I've probably done about five or six layers in these cups I didn't actually count them but that's it we'll put them aside to cure and see what it looks like on the other side Wow that one they really pushed out from the center. That one, oh, it's so pretty. I love looking into it. And that is stunning. I really felt like that one needed just that little extra more. This was from the lid. And this was that little extra more I thought about for that blue one. I could embellish these and create them, make them even more beautiful. So that was my first go and I wanted to make sure, can I do this again? Let's trial this to see if I'm getting the same consistent results. So again, the resin was pre-mixed because I didn't want to use up time uh, mixing it on camera. Um, and it's in all six of those muffin sections this is a silicon tray baking tray um, and each of the what was I gonna say oh the muffin wells so where everything is inside is very shiny it's glossy um, if you have um, a silicon mold or any other type of mold that is matte on the inside in the wells um, the the resin will come out matte it will pick up that um, so these ones are very shiny so when you pop it out you actually do get a shiny result which is amazing so again I've continued dropping in colours, dropping in the white over those colours. More colours, more white, more colours, more white. The left hand side is all colourful, the right hand side being single colours. So we'll see what comes from that. But if you just sit there and look at them you can see those changes, those reactions happening on the surface there it's quite hypnotic so they've all cured yay 
You can see on the bottom you can, that there are some effects. You can see through the red. Ooh! <laughs> so, I am, once again, really happy with how they've turned out. So I look forward to going larger, putting the money into buying a bigger mould. It's not just that top effect either, it's around the sides, like it's really incredible. Now the individual colours. Crazy, I would like to have so much more fun with this and I will for sure. <laughs> Alright, from my colourful heart to yours. Thank you so much for being with me. It means a great deal. Hit that thumbs up if you liked it and please make sure you're subscribed. Be fabulous!